Hey there and welcome to another Musician Reacts on the Dave Does channel. Today we are checking out the band Battle Beast and the song is Where Angels Fear to Fly. I uh, haven't had a chance to check this one out which is why I'm doing it as a reaction because if I had had a chance to check it out then it would be a review or I wouldn't be doing it at all. So I don't know why I said that in the first place. Um, but I have checked out Battle Beast recently. Uh, well when I say recently I mean in the, probably in the last three to four months I've done a reaction to them already. Uh, so I'm really looking forward to checking them, well, some more of them out. Now if you like this video please do subscribe click the bell icon like share leave the comments down below if you want to support this channel you can do so by joining the patreon it starts from only a pound a month and it greatly helps to keep this channel going and of course we have the band camp where music from the collaborations the originals from project 42 uh etc all on there available to download again which helps keep the channel going let's check this out so there's no pause in during the video uh occasionally i might say a few words during the song but generally i'll leave the thoughts and feelings at the end we'll talk about the lyrics at the end let's do it where angels fear to fly three two one uh, go <laughs> Get kind of hints of Doro on her voice on this particular song. The, the huskiness. I hadn't really noticed it before. What if Doro and Nora are in the same country? Let's make this the accent. So, no, they're not the same thing. I'm not always a big fan of Nora's vocals, but I really like it on this track. They say the songs are just the dark. Usually I kind of play it a little bit about it, but feel like full enough. This seems to sit really well in the mix. Interesting, okay. Spread it, baby.
Okay, there we go, Battle Beast, and we're Angels Fear to Fly. Good, good track. I uh, really liked it. I, as I said, I liked the vocals, um, and they sat really well and nicely in the mix. Uh, great lead guitar work. Um, classic power metal. Um, I really liked the song overall. I'm, it, sometimes I kind of listen to Battle Beast, and I kind of think of them as just a, not as good a version of uh, Beast in Black. And then in this case... I didn't have any of that sort of comparison. It felt like a completely different style of music and band and stuff like that. But there are some times when I do hear that comparison. Cause, yeah, and I do know, yes, people, you can put in the comments below, but uh, I know that people from Beast in Black were in Battle Beast, etc. So I, I understand why there is that comparison. Uh, but it's always been the fact that because Beast in Black is the band that I prefer. Uh, but this was a really good song. This one is the sort of one I would go back and listen to many, many times and would put it on playlists. Um, now I haven't looked at the lyrics I always look at the lyrics at the end unless the video is just like a static shot or something like that then I'll look at the lyrics during the video but in this case I always like to watch the video with no lyrics to see if it, the lyric if the video tells me a story so based on the, the idea of the song title and the video do I get what the story is about in this case no I don't uh, so we're Angels Fear to Fly so we've got a live performance uh, by the band We've got uh, Demon Horns on Nora. She's in the main video. There's some guys that have kind of captured her. And at the end, she kind of levitates up and they all cower. Now, is she meant to be the angel at that point? But it doesn't explain who the other people are. There's no kind of visual imagery to help me out there. So I'm, I'm not really sure on the video. So we're going to go to the lyrics and see where we're about. Uh, the birds are flying low. The same old song is going on and on. Way too many times I've seen this same old twisted pantomime. Okay, it hasn't explained anything there, but we're going to keep going. They say the darkest hours are just before the dawn. Then we, then we must die to be reborn. If I'm, oh, I'm still alive, I'm ready for the pain. If I fall, I'll rise again. I spread my wings and like the midnight sun I will be rising and the frozen heights where stars are born and where they die. So that kind of feels like, yeah, spread my wings into the midnight sun, I'll be rising to frozen heights, so rising to heaven uh, is kind of what that's talking about. Spreading your wings is becoming an angel. This die to be reborn. We've got lines here. I'm still alive. I'm ready for the pain. Okay. It feels a little bit... Uh, what's it called? Abject? So at the moment, we haven't really got a kind of clear, defined topic. Not that it ties in with the song title. That's where I'm kind of trying to see where I'm understanding this, the story. Uh, let's have a quick, like... I'm lighting up horizons with thunder and lightning through the darkest skies where even angels fear to fly. So you would fear angels would... Where where would an angel fear to fly? So the only place that angels might fear to fly would be in hell, I guess. They wouldn't want to go to hell, but they would be... If it's in the heavens, there shouldn't be anywhere they'd fear to fly, would they? I don't know. Okay, let's keep going. See if it gives me any kind of clarity as we get a bit further on. It felt like the end. They hit the ceiling and they fell and fell. The wind already blew and the rays of light were shining through. Hitting the ceiling. Now, the ceiling obviously is a physical hard surface. However, they could be talking about the ceiling where they can't climb anymore. The atmosphere is too thin, etc. So that could be the ceiling. That's why they fell and fell. They say the darkest hours are just before dawn again. So we get that line through the glass ceiling. We will fly. The truth comes screaming loud and high. I don't really know. I'm really not sure. So with the title of it being where angels fear to fly, I would have thought this is angels would fear to fly in like hell and stuff like that. But I'm not getting any kind of vibe of that. It's... It still seems to be for us all about flying above or in the standard kind of visualization, I guess. 
Hmm. I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. So if you know what the song is about, uh, let me know in the comments and then I will at least have a, a bit of an idea what it was about. But apart from that, though, the song was awesome. Uh, I loved what the band did with it. And I really love Nora's voice on this particular track. I thought it sounded awesome. Now, if you like this video, please do subscribe, click the bell icon, like, share, leave your comments down below. And remember, always be yourself. Unless you can be Batman, then of course be Batman. Take care.